Hello there everybody, my name is Waddles and today I'm coming at you with another 1.13 update aquatic guide. Today we're going to be looking at the wonderful, the really cool coral that is right behind me. This is the coral house I built for another video, but I'm going to go over coral. This will be a shorter one, I think, but once 1.13 comes out, I will be doing a full what's in 1.13 type of video, so make sure you look out for that. I think this might be one of the final guides before the update comes out, so yep. That's the thing. However, with that said, if you do want to see another guide, drop a like on this video so I know you like this type of video and tell me what kind of guide you want to see down below. So Coral is a brand new block in the update aquatic. There is five different variants of this block, kind of. So we have the blue tube coral, the yellow horn coral, the pink brain coral, the magenta bubble coral, and then the red fire coral now there's dead variants of these coral blocks as well and there is little coral plants as well as well lots of as well as uh, as fans which are basically the plant but it goes on the side of a block now these fans can be put on any block you want and same goes for these little coral plants as long as it is under water so if we go up here and we throw this coral plant on this block we cannot and we can't put the fan on the block either so it needs to be under water you also cannot put them on glass and blocks that you usually can't put things like this on now coral will die outside of water on java edition there's a little bit of a countdown if you will but on bedrock edition it will die instantly at least as of right now now, that could change when the update comes out. Also, in Bedrock Edition, according to the Wikipedia, you can grow coral when using bone meal on a block underwater. In Java Edition, uh, that is not a thing, sadly. Right here, if we take bone meal, it just does the seagrass. And if we go on this coral, it just does more seagrass. So, there's no growing any type of coral in Java Edition, as you're seeing here. It's, it's just making more seagrass, which is kind of sad. Now, to get coral, you need to find a warm ocean and look for something like this. Now, of course, I'm in a buffet world, so it's all warm ocean for me. But this is coral. This is what coral will look like in a natural, typical survival setting. Something like this magnificent biome. If you want to collect this stuff and bring it home, you're going to need Silk Touch on a tool because otherwise it will just go away. If I switch over into survival here without any kind of Silk Touch and we just start trying to punch at this thing, well, one, it's going to take forever. So if we go ahead and start mining this stuff up like that, we'll get dead coral. We didn't really want that. So if you find a random anvil that you didn't spawn in and you take your silk touch and you mine it then you get the coral color block itself which is pretty nice but again i'm very very sad uh that you can't really grow this thing as of right now in java edition because these textures are awesome even the dead textures are cool for something like a path but sadly that's not a really realistic possibility as of right now or at least not on a large scale Hopefully Java Edition and Bedrock Edition get the same features as each other in terms of coral. The whole second timer thing is very nice because what if you accidentally place it above ground and you didn't mean to and you didn't want your coral to just die? Then you could mine it right back up if there's the little timer. And what if you want to grow coral? Well, then you could do that too. So hopefully, like I just said, features get shared across the versions but that is pretty much it for coral i know i'm pretty excited about coral i actually really do like coral in general and the textures are cool but what do you think about coral and what do you think about the update in general tell me all of that kind of stuff down below like i said in the beginning if you want to see another guide tell me what guide you want to see if you haven't seen the other guides go check that out i've done stuff like the trident and stuff like fish so those are there for your viewing also, check out my pretty large, pretty epic 1.13 playlist. I think there's like 50-something videos on the playlist, and they're all focused on this update. I've done a lot of update coverage, so check that out as well. You might enjoy that. My name is Waddles. Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't, and then go have a good day. I will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.